All right, guys, welcome back to the Grizzlies Fan 37 video. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss another video. Now, if you missed it, we took a four-month break between tier lists. This is the second tier list after the break. The previous was restaurants. Today, we got soda. I'm excited for this one. I really hope you enjoy it. And as always, you can comment below any other idea you have. Without me saying anything else, let's get into the tier list. Starting off, we're putting Dr. Pepper in B. I used to love Dr. Pepper. This was my favorite soda drank it all the time, but recently in the past five years, it's just kind of lost that flavor and taste to me. I used to love it, and now I don't ever want to drink it. Something happened between these last five years where I just like, I don't drink Dr. Pepper anymore. I'm still going to put it in B because it is an average soda. Next up, we got Fanta, and I do not like Fanta. Now, I love orange drinks, but I do not like Fanta. There is something weird about that flavor. It just does not taste like an orange drink to me. And also, I think it's because when McDonald's got rid of Heisey Orange, if you know me, I love Heisey Orange. When McDonald's got rid of it, they replaced it with Fanta. And I feel like I have bad memories of Fanta now. Not a good flavor, not a good taste. Fanta's going in C. I don't like it. Next up, we got LaCroix or whatever that is. I've never had it. And honestly, I don't think I want to have it. I've heard some bad things about this drink. So I don't think I'm ever going to have this drink. It's going in the never had category. All right, guys. Next up, we got Schweppes. And I've actually never had Schweppes, but I do know they make tonic water, which like under some kind of light glows in the dark. So that's pretty cool. I might have to get it just for that, but I've never had Schweppes to drink. We have our first A into the competition, A&W Root Beer going in A. I absolutely love A&W Root Beer. Now, it's already good when it's in the bottle, but if you get it at an A&W restaurant, there is absolutely nothing better to drink. A&W Root Beer from the actual restaurant is the greatest thing I've ever drinking in my entire life. A&W is going to go in A, though, because I'm thinking it's talking about bottle form. All right, guys, next up, we got 7-Up, and it is going in A. We have back-to-back -back A's. It's not as good as the A&W, but it is still a very good soda. And for some reason, I can't even say what I like about it. It's just that good. I just will continually drink it. I don't know what it is about it, but 7-Up is a good soda. It deserves an A. All right, guys, something you need to know about me is I absolutely love root beer. You will not see a root beer in this tier list under the B. I absolutely love root beer, all kinds of root beer. Mug is a level down from A&W, but it is still a very good root beer. It's going in the average. I told you earlier that I loved orange soda, and this is one of them. Sunkissed Orange is the greatest orange-flavored soda out there. There is something about that flavor that just brings you back in every single time. It is so, so good. Sunkissed, going in A, and it could be higher than that. Next up, we got Canada Dry, and I'm really debating with myself to put this in an A or B. I originally thought B, but now that I think about it more, I'm going to put it in an A. Canada Dry deserves an A. I absolutely love the ginger ale. It always makes me feel better. Like, it always makes me feel better. And that's why I'm putting it in an A. When you have a soda that can make me feel better when I drink it, that's how you know it deserves an A. Canada Dry going in A. Please rise for the king of root beer. Everybody tells me it's Barks. But I like saying Barg's better because it sounds better. Barg's root beer is, there's nothing like Barg's root beer. I absolutely love the flavor of it. It is the one of the best sodas out there. Absolutely love Barg's root beer. It is the first root beer I'll choose between any of the A&W mug or Barg's. Barg's is at the top. It's going in S. Guys, I love this creator. He put Clorox on here. That is epic. And as much as I want to put it on S... I'm going to put it on the never had category because I'm not going to lie to you guys. I've never had it. I probably never will, but I like this guy for putting Clorox on there. Nicely done, creator. Clorox, unfortunately, never had. Next up, we got a staple of soda, Coca-Cola going in A. I absolutely love Coca-Cola. Do I like it more than Pepsi? You'll just have to wait and find out. But guys, I absolutely love Coke. The Coke from McDonald's is the best Coke you'll ever get. Coca-Cola, a staple of sodas, is going in A, and it's a high A, too. All right, guys, next up, we got Orange Crush, and this is another orange soda that I absolutely love. Just because it's in the B category does not mean it is the same ranking as the Dr. Pepper and Mug. It is 20 times better than that. It's a high, high A, Crush Orange. I will drink it if it's there. Don't be fooled by the B. Crush is going in B. Guys, I didn't know Capri Sun was a soda, but I guess I'll still have to rate it since it's on the tier list. This is going to go in B. This is an average drink. I like them. I like them a lot. They used to be a big part of my childhood. I would drink them a lot in Lunchables and stuff. Um, they're good. They're not A quality, but they are very close to A quality. They're going in the B category. It isn't a tier list without somebody putting in a brand I've never heard of before. What does it say? Fresca? Never even heard of Fresca, so that easily means I've never had it. It's going in the never had category. 
Oh, yeah, Kool-Aid going in A. I absolutely love Kool-Aid. I love all flavors of it. And unfortunately, I've not had it in such a long time, but I can't really remember the taste that well. But I already know as soon as I have it, I'll remember that taste. Kool-Aid is a very deserving of an A. I absolutely love Kool-Aid. It's going in A. All right, guys, next up, we got Squirt. Never even heard of this. It's another one going in the never had category. All right, guys, next up, we got Snapple. And I've actually never had Snapple either, but I do like Apple. So, hey, I don't know. I might have to try it sometime if that's even what it tastes like. But Snapple going in the never had category. All right, guys, next up, we got Mellow Yellow. And this is not one of my favorite drinks. I very, very rarely drink it. I think I've drinking it like one time. And I just didn't, I don't remember. I don't like the flavor of it. So it's going to go and see. Don't like it. Man, guys, here we have the run of Never Had and See. I've never had Monster Energy, and I honestly don't plan on drinking it anytime soon. I don't really like energy drinks that much. Way rather go with Gatorade or Powerade. You know what I'm saying? No? All right, next one. Let's go. All right, guys, we got Mountain Dew, and as I just said, I don't really like Mountain Dew. I've only had it a few times, and it's just the flavor just isn't there for me. I don't honestly, I don't see why everybody likes drinking it so much. The flavor to me just isn't that good. Mountain Dew is going in C. Bring on the Coke lovers, Pepsi, going to the top. It is up there as one of the best sodas of all time. I probably just started a war on the channel, Pepsi versus Coke. Comment below what team you are. I'm team Pepsi, and as you know, I love Coke as well, but Pepsi is another level on top of that. Pepsi, going to the top as one of the greatest sodas of all time. Next up, we got Pib Extra, and this tastes exactly like Dr. Pepper, so I'm not going to put it any higher than a B. I don't like Pib Extra. I don't like Dr. Pepper. don't like Pib Extra. It's going in C because it's not very good. Next up, we got Sierra Mist. I've never had this, but by the image, it does look very good. I might have to try this. It looks like a 7-Up Sprite kind of pop, so I might have to try that sometime, but I've never had Sierra Mist. All right, guys, that's going to be it for the tier list. Sprite going into the B category, but a very B high quality B. 7-Up and Sprite taste the exact same to me, so I don't taste any difference. But the reason 7-Up is higher than Sprite is when I think about which one I want to get, it's always 7-Up first. So that is why 7-Up is a bit higher than Sprite. But honestly, I taste no difference. And that will be it for the soda tier list. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to comment if you agreed or disagreed with my picks, what you would change and what you want to see in the next tier list. But guys, hope you enjoyed it. See you guys next time.